CCU scrimmaged for about 45 minutes. First live hitting for Coastal under new head coach Joe Moglia. Not much offense today. Here are some of the highlights. Senior Jeremy Height, well, a few runs of five yards or more. And then sophomore quarterback Cody Craig with a completion here to former Wilson High star John Israel, a WPDE all-zoner. And then back to the ground, sophomore running back Zach Silverbird breaks some tackles, picks up first down yardage, and it's Cody Craig back to the air, off the play fake, hits Niccolo Master Mateo. He caught several balls in this scrimmage. No touchdowns today. All points were scored on field goals by Grant Clayton from short range. Number one quarterback, Aramis Hillary, is intercepted here by Marcellus Hunter. It was a scrimmage dominated by the defense with no trips to the end zone during the workout. Here's Coach Moglia. You've got an entire new offense, defense, and kicking game, and you've only had seven days of practice. Uh, there's always going to be a little bit of a tendency on our guys' part to be a little bit unsure of what the responsibilities are. That's kind of what we're going through. This is also the first day we're going live. I've been pleased with the effort. I've been pleased with the intensity, but we've got a long ways to go. Is Hillary your quarterback, as was reported in the news? We're going to make that decision at the end of the spring game, but certainly Hillary would deserve that opportunity. Defense ahead right now? Yeah, I think so. I think so. But again, it's a little too early. At this time of the season, especially with everything new, it would make sense for the defense to be a little bit ahead. You're a pretty patient guy. You're uh, you're not kind of getting antsy for them to make a move and maybe get in the end zone? <laughs> If they get in the end zone, that means the defense probably made a mistake. So I'm kind of rooting for both sides. 